Welcome in. We're so excited. We've got the folks from the Holidaysburg Area Senior High School. We've got Holly here. We also have, we've got Alice who plays Anastasia. We've got Jack who plays Dimitri. Ben who plays Vlad. And Brenna who plays Lily. Thanks for coming on the show. Thanks yeah, for having thanks. us. So we got to get the viewers to stay tuned because you're going to be doing a couple performances in just a bit. But Holly, for people who aren't familiar with Anastasia, Tell us what it's all about. So it's based on the animated film of the same name, and um, it's a lot of songs that were added to the production. Um, this is the Broadway version of the musical, which came out in about 2017 and was off Broadway in 2020. So it's very new, very contemporary. Um, a lot of the same songs that we know from the animated film, but with a bunch of new songs as well. And how long have you guys been working on this for the final performances? Like. It takes a long time to rehearse, a lot of blood, a lot of sweat, a lot of tears. <laughs> and now November 16th through the 18th, our viewers right here in the A14 will get to come out and see you guys. So how long did it take to prep? Well, we had auditions in May, um, and we cast the show before school even ended for the um, current, or from the previous school year, and um, we started rehearsals as soon as school began in August. This so, is exciting. Long journey. Yeah. Okay, I did love Anastasia, the movie, as a little mm -hmm. girl, um, and it's based on history, mm -hmm. the true, you know, Russian history. So you play Dimitri. I play Dimitri, yeah. Okay, tell us, um, how was it for you to get into that role and character? Uh, it was difficult at first, definitely, but um, we actually had a really amazing opportunity to speak with the uh, uh, actor who played um, Dimitri on Broadway, Derek Klena, which was absolutely fantastic. He really helped me to get into the character, but um, I really just kind of started thinking like a con man, you know, trying to get, <laughs> yeah. get athletic, have some fun with it. Okay, that's amazing. You got to speak to the person who's playing Dimitri on Broadway. Yeah, or, or previously played. Yeah, but that's so impressive. Any pointers that he gave you? Yes, he did. Uh, some movements for the high notes, definitely, because it's it's really pushing the range, and um, also just to get moving. I'm not really a very good dancer either, so I got to keep that in mind as well. <laughs> That's why you just have to embrace it, right? right. Mm -hmm. Okay, so then Alice um, Haslam, you're playing Anya slash Anastasia. Yes. You're the lead. You're, like this is a big deal. Yeah. <laughs> um, how do you feel? Um, well, I feel very honored. Um, it's my first year in high school theater. I'm a sophomore, so it was definitely very um, surprising when you know the cast list came out. I was, I was just really happy and I was really honored to be given the opportunity. Okay, did you get any pointers from a Broadway star? Yes, I did. Um, <laughs> he, um, he was wonderful. He worked through one of um, our scenes and he just kind of talked us through you know, getting into the emotion of it and, you know, kind of our characters realizing that the moment they're in and it was just wonderful. I was starstruck the whole time. <laughs> That's wonderful. So are you two going to be doing a scene for us today? We are, yeah. yeah. And what is it called? Um, it's called In a Crowd of Thousands. Okay, so that one's coming up right after the break. Yes. I love it. Okay, now we have Brenna who plays Lily. Brenna, tell us a little bit about your role. Um, Lily is the lady-in-waiting to the Dowager Empress, who is Anya's grandmother, and she's very cynical, very sassy, so it's a very fun role to play. Oh, I love that. Does that fit your character as, as a, you know, a normal, everyday um, team? I or don't is this go that high, <laughs> but... It's it's very it's very fun to play. It's like a very loose character. Okay, that's wonderful. Okay, and then next we've got Ben who plays Vlad. Tell us about your character. Well, Vlad is Dimitri's best friend, a fellow con man. He's more like a mentor to him because he's a little older, a lot older. But um, my character, I go when we try to go to Paris. I have to go and try to swoon Lily into helping us as the Dowager Empress's lady-in-waiting, that's our way in. Mm -hmm. okay. If I can get in good with her, we can get in. Oh, so some schmoozing. Yeah. Yeah. Now, are you two going to be singing together? We, we will. will, and that will be me trying to convince her to remember uh -huh. the fling we once had. Yep, okay, <laughs> and what is that called? The Countess and the Common Man. Oh. I love that because there's some juxtaposition too with different titles and yes. social status. Um, what do you think are some themes or some takeaways that you would like people when they're leaving the theater to think about? Well, I think it's definitely a show about, you know, discovering who you are and, you know, connecting with, you know, yourself. 
and I think that's a really special thing. And so I think if our audience is able to, you know, kind of take a moment to reflect on that, um, I think it'll be worth it. Oh, I love it. It's so wonderful. Holly, you must be so proud of them. So proud. <laughs> so proud of them. And you've been yeah. working with Stephanie Everett. I have been. We're co-directing this year for the first time. Stephanie's been directing the productions for quite a long time and then asked me to join her this year um, in directing this production. So it's been a wonderful experience co-directing. We are a really good team and uh, we complement each other really well with our styles. This is fabulous. So we are going to get a sneak peek in just a bit, but can you tell the viewers the best way to get tickets and, and how they can reach you guys? Absolutely. So you have a couple options. Um, you can go to um, the box office before the production begins. Um, it'll be open about an hour before our production starts each day. Um, you could also email at harp at hasdtigers.com. Um, you can also um, call the box office at 695-4416, extension 7525. Wonderful. And I just have to ask, has being in this performance and musical theater made you guys want to maybe do this as something as a career? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's definitely a lot of hard work. Um, yeah. And it's definitely would be on a whole nother level to do that professionally. But, you know, it's definitely, I mean, me personally, I've definitely, you know, mm -hmm. thought of it. Yeah, that's wonderful. And I'm sure just even chatting with the Broadway stars and them giving you their time, that must be something that gives you some motivation too. Absolutely. I love it. Well, thank you so much. So after the break, we're going to be seeing the uh, folks from the Holidaysburg Area Senior High School perform some scenes from Anastasia. You're not going to want to miss it. Plus, giving back to the community. We're talking about the Patrick L. Weiss Senior Memorial Foundation and more. We're going to sit down with the founder in just a bit.